All right, class. Uh, let's look at this. Total amount of water in ABC is this. Okay, so ABC gives you amount this. And this is what you did to the water. And then after that, the fixed points here. The ratio of the water in ABC now is this. So I'm going to draw this first. Then after that, we will find the total amount of water now. Okay. So A is one unit. And remember, this is drawing now. Okay. And uh, B is 4 unit. 1, 2, 3, 4. And C is 3 units. Alright, so I have this done. And let's look at this. So A is to B is to C. All nicely done, drawn. Let's look at what's next. Okay, now given this, I'm going to work backwards. I pour out half of the water from A. So before, it should look like that. Before you pour out half the water, now I'm going to put it back. Which is 2 units now, right? Because half pour out, I'm going to put it back. And then B, double the water in B. After double, it becomes this way. So the before should be this size, like that. Okay. and add 90 ml water into C so C add 90 ml so C is something like this so the 90 ml is somewhere here and so therefore the whole thing before is actually 1380 which is stated here Okay, 1380 ml. So let's work everything out based on before. And this is what we are looking for. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So therefore, must add this 90. 1380 plus 90, I get 1470. So 7 units equals to 1470. 1 unit equals to 1470 divided by 7, I get 210. And knowing that this is 1 unit is 210, I'm interested in this now. So there's a total of uh, 8 units here. So I'm, oops, I multiply accordingly. 210 times 8, I will get 1680. And therefore, I get the answer. Okay, let me explain the second question now. Okay, Steve Edward Ben has this, and this is what happened to everything. And then, um, the what's fixed is this. This is what happened now. Okay, um, now. T S E B S E B. Okay. Steve will be four units. Okay. Is to E will be two units. Is to Ben. Ben is one unit. Okay, so this is what happened now. And again, find the total number of stickers the three boys have now. Okay, total number of stickers the three boys have now. So this is what you're interested to look at at the end. Let's draw the before. And based on this again, let's look at this. Steve dropped one third. If Steve dropped one third, he would have left two thirds. And this is what he has left, two third. So this is one third, two third, left two third. I'm going to put everything back. So you see, it is about the same. Okay, the size is about the same. Two 
so I'm going to put everything back I'm going to put two units back right because you can see this is one third two third three third okay Edward double his number of sticker if Edward double that means it should be single previously and Ben add another 68 so because of the fact that uh, Ben add another 68 then it became one unit so therefore this part here is actually 68 okay so the total is 652 and therefore I can start doing this now I'm going to add this with this so that I have a nice 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 unit I have a nice 8 unit Okay, so 652, I add with 68, I get 720, and therefore 8 unit equals to 720, 1 unit equals to 90. Okay, and once I find that 1 unit equals to 90, I will move back here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I'm interested to search for 7 unit which is 90 times 7 and I get this answer and uh, they are looking for stickers so no particular unit just write answer 630 alright I'm done I hope you get all correct so that you don't need to view my video <laughs> okay bye